puzzles are a fun way to teach basic shapes and sizes and even more complex subjects such as sequencing, vocabulary, math, and grammar. To create a puzzle as part of your Tiny Tap lesson, first design your slide. In this demo, we'll create a puzzle about musical instruments. Even though this page will eventually become a puzzle, remember to always design the layout as if the puzzle is actually pieced back together. This means, for example, that a sequencing activity should be arranged in the correct order, a vocabulary activity should be designed with the matching words in place, and so on. You'll carve the pieces out in the next step, but the initial design should always look like your puzzle has already been solved. In this demo, we'll arrange the words drum, violin, and piano directly underneath their corresponding instruments. Here's another tip for designing the layout of your puzzle page. It's best to keep an empty section so that you can position your puzzle pieces in a way that won't obscure the grooves. When your design is complete, tap Add Activity and Next to carve your puzzle. Select Cut a Shape Puzzle from the menu of Interactive Layers. Cut the shapes by tracing them with your finger or stylus. Tap the plus sign and then position them on the page by dragging them to the desired area. Keep in mind that if you're aiming to test your player's comprehension of the material and not just their ability to match shape sizes, it's best to trace identical puzzle pieces so that players won't be able to simply guess the matches according to their fit. To do this, double tap on the first piece you cut out to get that same shape and then slide it over to the next area you wish to cut out. You can add audio to accompany your puzzle pieces by tapping on the green pencil and then recording. Violin. Piano. Drum. Tap on the cog for a few additional options like free play, easy mode, and 3D shapes. You can also record an intro to your puzzle, which is key for giving your player context and instructions. Let's test your knowledge of the musical instruments. Go ahead and match the instruments in their names. Tap done, and your lesson's ready. Let's test your knowledge of the musical instruments. Go ahead and match the instruments in their names.